Give my pizza pump. That's my pizza. Give me that pepperoni pizza. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Stephanie and if you already know who I am, welcome back. In today's video, I am going to be doing a look that is very wearable for school and very easy to do. I wanted to say you do not have to wear makeup to school to be all beautiful or be popular or have friends. You should just go out as yourself if you want to wear makeup just because you love it. You should go ahead and do that. If there's any teachers out there that always tell you that's too much makeup. Is that the reason why you're late? You tell them, yes. <laughs> Bye. No, I'm kidding. Don't say that. You'll get in trouble. <laughs> if you are interested, keep watching and let's carry on with this video. <laughs> hey guys, so I'm going to start it off by telling you what I used for my eyebrows because I did do it again. Like, always. I'm sorry. The product that I used for my eyebrows is the Anastasia Wiz thing. But, where it's not in your budget, I suggest you buy this one, which is from L'Oreal. And this is like almost the same as this one. I really like this one and I didn't use it today because I'm already out. I'm going to start priming my eyes with the NYX. So if this was like a school day, I would probably use my finger because ain't nobody got time to look for those brushes. I'm going to just use my finger and dab it on my eye. And I'm just going to put it all over the place, but mainly on my lid. So what I'm going to use for my eyes is, is this. It's the Tarlit in Bloom palette from Tarte. Girl, I think if you're in school right now and you need a good palette, this is it because it has like your shimmers, it has your matte colors. It's a good variety of different shades. I'm going to take Flower Child and I'm going to put this all over my eyelid. So let's put this all over my eyelid like so. So, and I'm even taking it in here because we need that to really be brightening and brightening and brightening. I'm taking the shade Sweetheart, which is this color right over here. Just gonna be putting it above my crease and just really blending this out. So I'm taking Rebel right over here, and I'm gonna put that on my crease. Now I'm taking a little bit more and putting it in the outer and creating the V shape. So now I'm going to take the fluffy brush again and I'm going to take Sweetheart and I'm going to be blending out everything with it. So I'm going to put it up here and just blend it out. Taking a little bit more of Rebel and I'm just going to make everything a little bit more defined. Taking a little bit more of Flower Child and I'm just going to take it right on the eyelid just to make everything look clean. taking funny girl and I'm gonna put this on the brow bone just to give it a little bit of glow for the concealer I'm going to be using the Maybelline age rewind and it looks like this I'm going to be using the Maybelline foundation and I'm going to be popping this right onto my face. Oh, I'm hungry. Drag it. Some with my finger first and I'm just going to dab it all over here. To be honest, I don't even think I would wear foundation to school. I would literally only wear concealer. But maybe you could just switch to concealer with foundation and not wear concealer and save some time. And this foundation doesn't give it like full coverage, it gives like a medium coverage. I'm going back to the eyes and I'm going to be using 
the rebel color and I'm gonna be just patting that underneath so I'm taking a little bit more of the funny girl shadow and I'm gonna put this in the inner corner just so that part could glow a bit I'm not going to contour my face, but I am going to bronze it up. I'm going to use the Festation Formula bronzer, and this one is Butter Bronzer. And I'm just going to take some and put it over here. For the blush, I'm going to be taking this one. It's from Essence. I haven't really used it. I think I only used it once. Take some from this side because it's pink. It gives a little bit. I'm going to put some on my nose. Does anyone else do that? I like to put blush on my nose too. Like, just a little bit. For the eyeliner, I am going to be using the NYX Matte Liquid Liner and it looks like this. Okay, like that. Oh, oh, oh. I feel like my eyes need to glow more so I'm going to take a little bit more of the funny girl and I'm just going to put a little bit more and I'm going to take it a little bit high up Hink no I won't go Hink no I won't go The reason why I like to use matte shadows is because you are going to school When there's a dance in school you want to make sure you pop out a little bit more with metallic eyeshadows which is why it's a good idea only to wear like matte shadows during the regular school days you know like this it's like chill and then when there's a dance you're gonna be putting that metallic eyeshadow looking bomb af and, look fly, and then they're gonna be like oh damn look at her makeup so the lipstick that i'm going to be using is from colourpop and it's called november this is the ultra stain lippy this is my first time actually using a colourpop lipstick or anything like that the brush looks a little bit weird I like this lipstick, it's pretty comfortable. And this is a liquid lipstick, it's not a liquid matte lipstick. It almost feels like the NYX creamy lipsticks. Mmm, this feels nice. This one is called Mineral Infused Mascara from e.l.f. And I'm going to be popping this right on to Alright guys, so this is the finished look. This is actually how I would probably go to school if I was still going to high school. It's the finished look. So it looks like this. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and do come back next time. And make sure you check down below because I am going to be putting the products that I use down there. And if you want to follow me on any other social media, it will also be down below. And I think that's it. So make sure you come back next time so it could be fun. Okay, bye.